Good morning, good morning, everyone. Happy Sunday today. I am so excited to be alive. It is a beautiful day. The ducks and geese are on the pond. Um, the other day we had a turkey in here and oh my God, the big, it is a huge bird. That turkey is a huge bird. Um, I just wanted to touch base a little bit on how to find my bags. Um, when it comes to looking for my bags, please, please, if you type in dot, dot, goose design, don't just put in dot, dot, goose because dot, dot, goose might bring up other places to go. And I am only dot, dot, goose design. Um, I only sell project bags and that's the only thing I sell. I sell for cross stitchers. I don't, I don't have anything, um, on there that would be suspicious or anything like that. So if you guys get into a, a, a dot dot goose that is not me, please just get out of it and go dot dot goose design. I will even link my shop down below and that's easy as that, right? Um, anyways, I also want to talk a little bit about, so I talked about that. Now I'm going to leave that go and I'm going to talk a little bit about bags and my projects. So I know you guys really, really love this bag. This bag went over really, really good. It was the Green Gable bag. I only have, if I have, I'll know by the end of the week how many I actually have left over and I might put it back into the, um, into the, in, on my Etsy shop or um, just contact me personally and be put on a wait list and then I'll put you on a wait list and then if one comes available then I will be able to sell it to you and or, and or I might be able to even sell my um I'd like to sell my samples just because um I you know they're beautiful and everybody seemed to like them so I did finish my primrose cottage uh I finished the Quaker the spring Quaker so that's what I did. I put a little kitty kitty in there. I took out one of the motifs and put in a little kitty. Isn't he cute? Um, you can't really see him really good, but I can see him and I know he's there. So I would like to um, finish this as a pillow. So maybe next week I can finish as, as a pillow. I use the Blooming Crocus uh, Classic Color Works. I only used one of these. Now do remember I used 40 count... Um, I used a 40 count opalescence on mine and I only used one of these. In fact, this is what I have left of the one, because I only used one thread. So this is what actually what I have left of my opalescence or of, of the Blooming Crocus. And I did use it and I did use the, um, the opalescence. It's kind of got a shimmer, a little bit of a, a shimmer to it. It's kind of cool. I really like it. Um, yeah, I really, really like it. I thought that's really cool. So I wanted to show you, I did finish something. I did, I did, I, and it didn't take long. It was, it was, I just said, okay, do this. I, I, I focused in on like 2024 and this little thing. And then before you know it, I was like, oh, I got, I could get this done and I can get this done. And it was, it was a pretty easy stitch. I think the next one I'm going to do will be the 4th of July one, but that one will be after the sal that I'm going to talk about. I mean, I have a sal coming up and that's starting next Sunday. Um, I did post it on all my social medias and I did use this bag. Um, I'm using, um, we are doing, me and the Stitching Bee are and a bunch of gals. And maybe I even have some on my Facebook group. I might even post it on my Facebook group, you know, every every day that what I do. So what I'm going to do is I'm doing Erin um, Elizabeth's designs. And I'm doing this one. I'm doing um, American flag, her American flag. And I'm just going to do like one week, I'm going to do the blue. And the next week I'm just going to, and, and I'm stitching it on white. Now you can stitch it on a different color, but then you may have to use white. Then you may have to stitch in the white where I'm using, um, the opalescence again. Um, I'm using, uh, I'll show you what I'm using, but this is, uh, this is what I'm doing first. Week one will be the blue. Week two will be the red. Week three will be this red and maybe week four will be this red. So I'm going to do it at my pace because, you know, I'm putsy. I'm still working on my Sue Spargo salad days. Um, I'm on April um, block. And unfortunately, I cannot show you that because that is against all the rules um, when I'm in the when I'm in the stitch along or in the block of the month. So I thought that was grace, but it's not. Um, so I have to um, I have to um, do that. Um, I have to start, I'm starting this on Sunday, actually. So if you want the pattern, you can get it at, um, at the Stitching Bee, or you can call her and see if you can jump in. You can still jump in even after the 26th. I think I'm starting the 26th 
or is it the 20th? Oh, I'm starting the 28th. So you can even start after that. Um, I do still have bags available. This is the bag that I'm using with it. It's called um, Stitching Across America. I thought this was really cool because it's got all the states in it. So find your state. Say, hey, I live in New Hampshire. Here it is, New Hampshire, you know? And it's got all the states. And if you are a teacher, it'd be a good way to show all the kids, hey, you know, find uh, New Jersey, find Wisconsin. You know, it's it's a really cute little bag that you can show off. Um, it has red, white, and blue um, uh, red, white, and blue colors. Uh, I have a blue zipper, white zipper, or a red zipper. So if you want uh, any of those colors, be specific. Otherwise, you know, whatever I pull out that day, that's what you're going to get. So if you don't, if you're not specific, then you'll get, you'll get my choice. <laughs> um, anyways, it also comes with, um, also comes with this pal, um, the pal, the pal with the bag is $42 free shipping. By the way, I have free shipping domestic free shipping and just the bag is $30. Um, I do still ship free. doesn't matter if you buy the one bag, two bags, 10 bags. I do all the fruit, all the shipping. I send it. Um, I send it. So anyways, I'm using along with her, I call for the call for colors, which is the um, dinky dyes. And it is um, one of them is, I don't remember both of them. I don't know which one they are. I think I'm using the dinky dyes that she has on the back which is shades of wine and something else. I can't remember. So these are the ones I'm using. These are the two threads I'm using. But if you're going to go with a, a, a different color backing, then you'll have to use white. But I decided I was going to do a white on white fabric. I know everybody's going, oh my God, I hate white. Well, you know what? It's really not that bad. I did white on that um, on that other one and it was really cool. Oh, this is 36 count. It's a linen and it's opalescence. So I have this. Um, uh, my piece is um, eight by ten. That's what um, they cut it for. Because then I get, I think I get a two inch border all the way around. Um, I did talk to um, um, Chantel um, from One Forty One, and she is going to look into maybe doing a board with a star on it. I would that would be really really cool. Um, and if that's the case, then I will shout her out, and I will um, I will post on there. You know, if she um, if she does do it, I'm going to post her her um, her shop and then you can um, buy her. You can buy the finishing there. I'm going to try and do that because I would like it on a board with a star. I think that'd be really cool. So that is I'm using this thread, this fabric with this thread on this sal with these bags starting next Sunday. This is the 21st. So I'm starting it next Sunday. You can jump in whenever you want. You know, you might be a faster stitcher. Hey, if you start on the 28th and finish on the 29th, all right. I'm going to put a special um, uh, a special um, hashtag or put it in my Facebook. You know what? I think that's what I'm going to do. Is I'm going to put it in my Facebook and whoever, um, I'm going to put it on a special thread every week. And then every week I'm going to give um, um, a prize. Um, to somebody and then I'm going to send the prize to that person whoever finishes it the week one to you know whatever week they're on or if you're if you need to catch up that's fine too so I'm going to do it every Sunday because I do it I, I yeah I'll do it on Sunday because I have a special uh, on my Facebook I usually do show off Sundays and I'll also do um, show off America or something you know and we'll have them all on there I'll figure it out don't worry about it then I want to show new bags because I have some new bags coming up I'm going to call this one. Oh, and I, you know what? Mother's Day is coming up. So don't forget mom on Mother's Day. These are great gifts for Mother's Day. She might not be a cross stitcher, but she might be a Sue Spargo fan. And she can put all of her threads in there for Sue Spargo. Um, she may be a um, Primitive Gathering fan. And she could put all her Veldani threads in there. Um, what else can she put in there? Oh, you know, important papers. Sometimes I put some of the dog papers in there. Um, my pet... I have Gracie's um, special papers in there. I have Miley's special papers in there. And then I put them underneath my bed so I know where they are. Um, you can put those in there because a 9 by 13 um, legal size, is it 9 by 13? Yeah, legal size paper does fit in here. So she could put all of those in there. Or if you're a mom and you want to just buy it for yourself, I think it's a great idea. I think I'm going to call this one um, Hilly Haven because look, it's got a whole bunch of hills in it. And who doesn't want to, you know, have a cute little bag like this? So I have pink, 
or I have this color. I think this is kind of a purpley. And then I have the green. So, and I do have um, a pal, but I just don't have it made yet. So all bags are $28. And do um, I do have my card. I want to post my card. I'm going to show you my card. This card is, um, it is actually, oh, listen to that. Two and a quarter by two and a quarter. And you could use this on your, on your um, piece. I don't know where I'm going to start this one, but I'm going to say, hey, I know that it's a two inch, um, it's a two inch uh, border that I have to have. So then I'm going to say, oh, I'm going to do this two inch border. Oh, I have to start over here. Um, this is going to be my two inch border. Use my label or my, my, my business card. And I'm going to start it right there. And that will give me a two inch border. Isn't that cool? That's why they're square and keep them in all your bags. So this way then, you know, you might not order right away. You may order six months from now, even a year from now. I have a discount code and that one is never goes out of style. So that's 10% and you don't even have to be a repeat customer. You can be a new customer. You can still use that and you can use it countless times. And if it doesn't work, um, make sure that when you are checking out on Etsy, I am your, the only thing that you're checking out because a lot of times it'll ask for a discount code and because you might have other Etsy shops on there that you might have in your cart, take those out and save those for later. Make sure I'm the only one that you're checking out and then the code will work. And if it doesn't work, send me a message. Say, hey, Denise, that code didn't work. Can I get 10% off? Absolutely. I will be happy to refund you your 10%. Not a problem. So I always keep bag. I always keep cards in my bag so keep them in your bag so you know where they are so this way then you can say oh where i know she has a discount code where is that it's in your bag keep it in your bag keep it in the bag so this is going to be a short video i think it might only be 15 minutes long it might not be very long it's because i just had one two weeks ago um always drama you know there's always drama going on in my life you know always something there was the dog the other day you know today there was you know something else yesterday there was something else I'm like oh my goodness when am I going to stop having drama I'm like stop stop having all this drama and it's, it has nothing to do with cross stitch because cross stitch is like my is like my go-to um then I also have again I found some fabric um I was fortunate enough to get it from a little quilt shop and um, down in uh, Georgia, and I really appreciate it because I feel like, hey, I'm, I love that fabric. So I found The Love of Nature by Teresa Kogan. I found this fabric, and super cute, right? This came out like two years ago, maybe even three. Super cute. I love this fabric. So these are out again and limited quantities. So get them while they're hot. Get them while I still got them because once it's gone, I am not going to get this fabric again. This fabric is super, super hard to find. So this has got the deer on there, the butterfly, her fox, a couple of trees, these really cool flowers. She has a house on one. She's got a raccoon. Um, just, I love, love, love these colors. It's kind of a beigey, tanny color. Um, I love it, right? It's just the coolest thing. I've had these for a while. Um, you can get a burgundy zipper on here, maybe a brown zipper. I kind of favored the burgundy because I like the burgundy color um, flowers. I thought those were kind of cool. Um, you could put use black if you want. Um, I could use green. You know, I mean, any colors are all good. So on that note, that is pretty much all I'm going to talk about is these new bags. Well, these aren't new because I have these out on my, it's called Love of Nature and they're $30 free shipping. Again, make sure you keep the um, the card in the bag so you know about my discount. So you have the discount always ready. And then um, next week or the following week, I am going to um, Farm Girl Dry Goods, Ru um, Michelle Rudy and Gary Rudy. I'm going to their retreat down in Amana. So if you're going to Amana, I hope to see you. Come and say hi to me. I'll be sitting with my friends, my stitchy friends. I'm super excited about that. I know that um, Michelle puts on a great retreat, great food, great atmosphere. Um, she never disappoints. So, and I'm staying at the Millwright. So if you're staying at the Millwright, let me know, because then um, me and my friends, we sh um, stitch after at the Millwright. We stitch like in these cute little lobbies <clears throat> on our floor, and we stitch in there, or we even stitch in people's rooms. You know, just come and see me if you're staying at the hotel, the Hotel Millwright down in Amana. Um, super excited about that in a couple weeks. Um, I am like super stoked. Uh, can't wait. 
can't wait for all the exciting stuff. I know that she has a really fun designer and um, she has some really cool stuff that she's going to be designing. So, and I, I, and I, you know, I'm just wondering, you know, it, I'm, not, I'm not bringing bags. So I, I might have a couple of bags, but you have to come to me. Oh, sorry, Michelle. Um, I might have a couple of bags that with me, but otherwise, um, I'm just going to tell you to go to my shop. You know, I'll give you uh, the 10% yet, and I will get them out uh, shortly after I get back from Amana. Um, I am really, really super soaked about going to this retreat. I am going to that one, and then at the end of the month, I'm going to another retreat um, in Spring Green, which is Country Sampler with Brenda Jave. Super excited about that. I just can't wait to see all my friends in Amana. I am so I am so, so excited. I've, I've just had so much drama in my life lately that I just need a really good retreat again. Um, I love going down to Primitive Gathering. I'm going to Primitive Gathering in, on Tuesday to see um, the um, Bernina president. So I know there's only a select few tickets and I got one of them. I was lucky enough to get one of those tickets. So um I might, I'm in a drawing for something, for a sewing machine or something. So I, I just want to meet the guy. I think it's really cool. I don't have a Bernina, but I do like all, I like sewing machines, so I'm not really picky. You know, I, I know I have a Juki. This is my Juki. Under the Juki. Don't be a turd today. That's my favorite saying. Don't be a turd today. Um, and, you know, I am really excited to go to that. And then on Thursday, I'm going with a bunch of my stitching friends and we're going to hang out there. And uh, and then the following week is Amana. Oh, I'm so excited. So, so excited for that. Can't wait. I know that I'm going to bring too much stitching like I always do. I'll probably bring my, um, if you want to see my Sue Spargle. Um, ooh, there was a bird. If you want to see my Sue Spargle um, salad days, I'm going to probably bring that along and show it, you know, spread it all out. It's really, really cool. Really excited about that. Um, what else? So that's pretty much it. You know, life is good. It really is. Life is always good when you have stitching in hand. You know, it really is. Oh, I love that saying. Life is always good when you have stitching in hand. Boy, isn't that a lot of truth? You know, be kind to people. You know, be kind. It is, it is one, it is one, it is something that is free um, just to be kind to people. And, you know, and don't leave, you know, don't leave negative comments, blah, blah, blah. You know, if you don't like something, scroll on by, you know. I'm lucky enough I have not had too many um, uh, negative um, uh, comments. But if I do, well, I'm just going to scroll. I'm probably either going to delete it. I'm not going to give it any attention. I'm not. It's just not going to happen. I'm sorry. And um, I'm not going to give that person any. Um, it's, she's not going to live rent free in my brain, in my in my head. One of my friends told me that one day and I'm like, yeah, you're right. She is not living rent free right here. No, she's not. So I'm not going to let anybody um, bother me or let them live rent free here. And I'm going to cut this short at about 20 minutes. So I love you all. Thank you so much for buying my bags. Um, deeply appreciate it. Super excited for some of the new ones coming up for Mother's Day. Don't forget the mom. Um, I have some really cool ones coming up, a lot of flowery ones, a lot of colors, a lot of spring colors, summer colors. Um, I do have one coming up that's a, a, a dark color one, but it has beehives on it. It's really, really cute. Um, I love bees. I think bees are cool. And it has no gnomes. Pro I promise no gnomes. I don't, for some reason, I'm, I have a lot of gnomes on my site. I'm like, where did all these gnomes come from? Coming out of the woodwork. Um, I'm trying to um, condense some of my fabric so I can get some new fabric. Um, I will be getting some really cool Halloween fabric. I'm super excited about that. I'll be ordering that today from uh, Primitive Gathering. And um, come and visit me at Primitive Gathering. Um, come and see me at Amana. You know, come and say hi and say, hey, Denise. And I'd love to take pictures and meet you and say, you know, and bring your bag. You know, I'd love to see what bag, what you have in your bag. So, you know, life is good when you stitch, when you have stitching in hand. So I love you all. Thank you so much. Mwah. Have a great day.